Hello and welcome to my Fox Populi Civilization 5 Let's Play, playing as Korean Empire. And this is part 15, or fairly realistically, the last part. Um, it's it's all going to come down to whether we can hold this city. Let me uh, just... Well, will we go next? Yeah, let's go uh, next turn. I think everything's sorted. Well, that's not good. Um, oh, it's just this guy moving. Um, if it is the last turn, you probably... Well, oh, that's also not good. Uh, we have met <laughs> more Vikings. You guys will probably know before me, because it might be in the title. I'll probably transition this episode into a recap. But hell, let's let's stay positive here. We have uh, the range units. <laughs> that's a lot of damage taken by that city. We have range units here that are fairly strong, beast-like, if you will. Um, we, I think we could potentially defend... Um, and it we're not so we're not hindering our civilization at the moment. We're not building new troops. Uh, I don't think I can. I don't have the money to get them out fast enough. So I may as well just build the buildings. Um, you to kill. That's oh that better not be my great. Uh, oh, there he is. Uh, my great diplomat there. A uh, worker. Probably. <laughs> this guy. Was. Yeah, that wouldn't be there. Yeah, this is Danish. They wouldn't have a worker here, so I'm guessing. Oh yeah, I think he was up, up uh, upgrading uh, that tile. And uh, we're not. A, yeah, okay, we're not a war with Genghis Khan. This just looks a bit. Oh, the, of course, the Danish could just pop onto my land and back off again. <clears throat> um. Let's see, Seoul, new population. That speed up forest, wouldn't it? Uh, I think I want to just stay hitting up, um, uh, hitting up specialists. They're just so powerful. Like, look what look what they give me here. Seven, three, one. We we'll call the golden age as one there as well. That's very useful. The tree uh, towards um, a great person. That's very useful. Minus two food. Like that's just that's just massive. Uh, with this tile here would give me what eight plus another half plus another half if I get two of them, so nine useful stuff. Whereas these tiles are getting me ten, eleven, even if you take the food away. Right. Uh, oh, let's let's get our great diplomat here into into Buenos Aires. Uh, wait a minute. <laughs> No, why? Why game? Everything was going bad, but manageable. Um, the Danish somehow have control of this. They didn't. In, they didn't a few moments ago. Okay, so I guess I just looked down at Hong Kong. Guess we go down to Hong Kong. Uh, do I go into the? I feel it's too dangerous to go into the war. Or, Maybe I can come, yeah, I'll come down here if I land and see if I can minimize my time in the water. Okay, I think I concentrate on the frigates. Okay, we have something to hit up here as well. <coughs> Right, do I want to concentrate on what's in front of the city? Maybe not, because that would allow the Danish in, although they seem to have less troops now than before. Uh, where is my splash damage guy? All the way back here, maybe? Uh, it's, it's too hard to see via this, uh, via this screen. So I actually miss having um, the little pop-up when I hover over them. I, I should be able to make it out there. i just seen what the... I, I thought it was this guy. Yeah, I, this icon here should be fairly seeable. I, I just don't see it. <clears throat> right, I maybe I should get him into the city. No, I think I need to get a, a more healthy person in. Maybe the field gun, in fact, that would um, give it a little boost. Nah, too dangerous. 
No, if I lose the city, I lose everything. Um, so who cares if uh, the field gun gets killed? Like, it's game over. Right, uh, I imagine somebody else can also reach that guy. Yeah, let's uh, kill him with that one. Yeah, I wasn't sure. Oh, we can't reach. What if I go up onto the hill? One, two. This this hill with a forest on it is going to give me problems. He should have moved into the city just so he could attack. I can move into this tile and get a hit or two. Is there any other options? Uh, realistically. Oh, if I move here though, uh, I'm open to. Frigates. I don't. It doesn't. Yeah, it looks like I can finish off the Portuguese frigates. So maybe it's not that big of a deal. <laughs> I forgot to hit twice, which is is sort of more like my raison d'etre. How does he take no damage? There was um, <laughs> there was Vikings right there. I guess they didn't want to attack. Okay, that's uh, that's good, I suppose. Oh yeah, we never checked on that worker. It was in fact the worker that died. And um, is there anything I can or should do about that? I'm not sure. Yeah, let's well, let's move him over closer. I guess. Um, we've done some good serious damage here. Well, let's just see how how much uh, health the city retains. We're gonna get a castle as well. I don't think that will actually help our. Um, I don't think that will actually help our health, but it will help our um, combat strength. I would like to see a help our our health. That would be interesting, but probably not. Okay, at least we're the third greatest builders in the world. What is this from, actually? Wonders. Ah, wow, we've got seven built. That's uh, pretty nice. Um, I had a talk during the uh, meantime about Hong Kong. Um, is is Hong Kong actually? Oh, it does give. It does provide that for. Uh, so there's no way through those mountains. See, I want to just uh, get into the water as late as possible. What was that? Oh, that might be a little pass through. Let's assume that. <laughs> uh, one time. Okay, our worker has disappeared. The Mongolians are amassing on our borders. Not good. Oh, the health jumped up there. Uh, I wonder if that's from... Oh, so did the city strength. I wonder if that was... Like, I think the city naturally heals at the end of the turn. But no, nah, that's too big of a jump. Um, I think that's the castle. I think that's that city saved. Now... Yeah, I think I'll just be able to kill things then. I was going to try and leave the Portuguese alive, perhaps. Um, I think it'd be very likely the Mongols will all of a sudden attack, though. I was hoping the splash damage would kill him. Alright. Uh, oh, you've no one to hit from this angle. Let's get him down here because that'll move him towards uh, Mongolia as well. Because I, I don't know. I <laughs> I think it looks possible, doesn't it, with the amassing of troops at all. Uh, I don't think I can uh, take the turn time to move him onto a road though. Uh, this is still a very serious threat. Uh, I might be able to afford the time to move the field gun down. No, no, I can't, because there's no one else to go into the city. If I had to move somebody else into the city, fine, but I didn't. So not fine. I was hoping to be able to hit him somehow. Uh, let's just go sleep in the city. Ooh, Portuguese Navy. That's a lot stronger than my guy. I don't... 
I don't know, if I got into this spot, I, I might be able to escape out into the waters. Hell, let's go for it. Oh, I should have checked what he has. Oh, Dreadnought. Um, good, so he's not going to be able to slow me down. But then again, AI units don't usually travel alone. Okay, we've got the city-states in the processing stage. So I'm pleasantly surprised that Mongolia hasn't attacked yet. <laughs> they, they, we are not a war Mongolia, that's a great sign. Oh yeah, he would have been dead if we were. Oh, maybe there is a pass-through here. No, that's that's where it ends. Um, yeah, we'll have to get into the war here and hope for the best. I think. Uh, if you've already gone out the siege promotion path, let's continue it. Okay, and again, if we're not at war with Mongolia, let's respect that. And um, well, I don't know what I was going to say there. Let's let's leave units here is what I'm sort of trying to say. Uh, I'm going to push splash. He's he's a bit of risk of getting killed, but splash damage is quite powerful there. I can hit two guys. Um, I'm sort of just leaving the <clears throat> the Danish alive. No particular reason, I don't think. I guess they're they're a smaller threat as far as I'm concerned. First of all, uh, Portugal are have more uh, points. Uh, second of all, and much more importantly, Portugal are closer. So if I actually hurt uh, the Danish navy. They can't, they can't continue the fight, really. It's just too far to go back, to fall back. We are increasingly vulnerable. All right. Aren't we... I think we've set up an arsenal and stuff. That should help. Uh, we could buy a great musician. Uh, we get so many bonuses from um, great works and stuff. I think that could be worth it. Yeah, I think you get it as early as possible. I think it's certainly uh, worth it. And I'm not sure did that in and of itself help my Golden Age points, I wonder. Right, I noticed this actually in the processing turn. So you got attacked, and in a really smart way, the AI moved this tile. Which means I have to move back, forward, back to get out. I run into more um, Portuguese units, I'm dead. Right, I think I can survive one more hit by that guy. And uh, I should be okay there then. I think I'm going to upgrade the splash damage guy. Where is he? Uh, next bit of money I get. I don't know, if he was range 3 with splash damage, that'd be pretty sweet, wouldn't it? Is that Caraval killed? Oh, I wonder. Um, I wonder did he uh, did he have extra units with him? I just realised now I'm talking through the processing turn. I'll probably edit the rest out. Okay, one of the pop-ups I received. Oh, there we do get those golden age points from that great person being born. Interesting. Uh, one of the pop-ups. I repeat, it was a great diplomat mission complete, so maybe think, maybe it was over here. It wasn't, but the Celts have got control of this anyway. Um, so how close are we? Oh, we're close enough. Now, I could have maybe, in that case, yeah, I could have maybe anticipated somebody would get control of this. Uh, more likely, these guys. And left him, like, maybe back in my own land. Um, still, whatever. Make peace with Buenos Aires. I must check if there's any other uh, units we can make peace with. Yeah. Alright, I guess I need to move a few troops up the road here. Right, speaking of road though, let's get him on the roads. Okay, I guess if we can hit someone, we hit someone. Otherwise, perhaps we heal. Um, 
don't think we'll get this kill, which is a bit shocking considering we have six attacks on them. But I guess they're, they're strong units. You gotta give them that. Uh, oh, there's a turret pillaged tile. Okay, let's keep an eye on our Golden Age points for expending the unit in this case. So 27 turns down to 23. And we're about to get a great merchant as well. Oh, that gives us a boost of gold. Nice. Um, yeah, I guess we're not going to see what happened over there. Uh, did it look like two different attacks, maybe? Well, whatever. We'll just uh, move on with our lives. So who would we like to promote? Um, actually, let me just get whoever's the best. Uh, 280. Oh, 170. Certainly not you in that case. Uh, 180. 270. So it's, it's probably this guy. Yeah. And conveniently enough, he's one of the few that's able to be upgraded. Um... Actually, I could just move him down. Oh, not that. Not now that I've upgraded him. I could have moved him down to finish him off, but that's fine. Yeah. Yeah. It's. I think I'm just gonna have to stay. I'm. I'm not gonna be able to go to war with uh, Mongolia until I make peace with the Portuguese. In that 15 turn period, I'm gonna need to turn around and attack the Mongols quick. Again, then I have to kill the Mongols quick. And I have to turn around and face the Celts, which I assume will attack me by then. And if not, I need to attack them. Okay, we... we <clears throat> are you finished? Um, okay, we are... We have another unwelcome war. This one's not too bad. Uh, it is a uh, Shaka. And even better, I don't think people like Shaka. I don't think he's at war with... I oh, unless he's just become a vassal. In which case, it doesn't really matter. Um... Yeah, denounced the Celts. Uh, good, that'll get us more friendly with the Celts, hopefully. Yeah, okay. Um, I don't think that's so bad in that case. I think we got into all this trouble by being friendly with the Sulus, just because I was naive and said, oh, I'll just be friends with whoever, um, which I think was a big mistake. Um, the Portuguese, where are they coming? Are they coming back to this city? To the capital, I'm not sure. I, I guess I'll just take the opportunity to heal him, whoever I can. Perhaps get... No, I'll just stay where he is and heal this guy he knows off the road. Mongols still haven't attacked. They might be too weak to really consider attacking. Uh, potentially. But then again, we're weak. Especially in the AI's eye. I, yeah. The AI's eyes. Um, <laughs> we're quite weak. But... With with the road, we do have the maneuverability to get down there quite quickly. Railway, oh, we're, we've started the turn already. Uh, railway's a good bit away. But, uh, <laughs> that great diplomat, I really hope he survives. Um... I don't think I can not attack. <laughs> then again, I'd love the chance to heal up. Yeah, let's uh, let's take the chance to heal up here. Everybody, even even people who can attack. Well, unless you're fully healed already, in which case, I I have the feeling that he's he's going to attack this city again. And let me get out here. Do we have frigates in the war? We do. Okay, you could be in a bit of danger. Um. Actually, you know what? I don't want to. I don't want to leave a frigate um, unmolested. So let's uh, let's hit him. Nice. How, what level is this guy? Fairly low, but he should be getting promoted. He's been uh, hitting quite reliably. Oh yeah, so this war against Shaka, does, I, 
yeah, I don't just don't see how this affects us. They have barely nothing left. Um, they, I don't think they have any real way to get to us, so let's not worry about that too much. Unless we need to keep an eye on this city state who controls it. It's it's not likely going to be Shaka though at any point. Okay, the Portuguese have continued their attack against our second city, which suits us well enough because our units are already there. I was having a closer and closer look. I think... Um, so let me move this guy first, I suppose. I'm looking for a road, I was. But that gets us into the right territory. If, <laughs> oh my god. If the Daners are someone getting control of this now and I lose him... I was feel annoyed. I could have. It might have been a little safer to let him sit back, and uh, then just make the last spurt into the town. Right, sorry. I was having a closer look at this guy. There's the splash damage. Yeah, all right. Um, and we'll. I think we'll make use of that, moving him back into the city. you You'll die from splash damage, I think. And uh, your frigate. Yeah, we'll do a bit of help against the frigate. Well. Oh, you're not the splash damage. You're going to be the epicenter of my hits. Go. Um, another... F oh, there's actually a few more frigates coming... Uh, two more frigates at least coming in. Uh, so he's a little at risk on the coast, but... You know, he's not that strong of a guy anyway. I could move up onto this hill. I think that's worth it. Uh, I, I want that frigate gone. And then allows me to hit him. Yeah, I, I, I would have been I would have been happier if I'd healed a good bit more. Um, I would I would like to think that the city would have been able to get a bit more heal healing done in the meantime. How are we looking? Anything? Um, any moves with buildings? This windmill is going to help a lot. Well, it's going to help 15% um, with the production of my other buildings. I think uh, that's it. We're done. Just when I was getting, maybe not confident, but a little more, um, well, a little more confident, we'll just say. Right, let me look at architecture first. Not much I can do with this, I don't think. Hermitage would be useful. Uh, I think everyone's allowed to build. Yeah, only one allowed per person. Plus one culture for every four citizens. 10% culture in the city uh, contains three slots for works of arts. So that's uh, we, we should build that maybe as soon as possible. Um, I'll tell you why I'm particularly worried again. Tucked diplomatic mission, I think that's plenty. Yeah, it's more than enough to get us control of that, which will get us, uh, fur. Oh, uh, we're about to get Golden Age as well, not, in the not-too-distant future. This great merchant might even do it. Or it'll be close. Maybe two more uh, great people. Yeah, so they're now attacking both cities. That's that's a problem, of course, it's straight off. Wow, this guy has frigates all around it. Um... And the Danish have come back with even more frigates. So we're in a bit of trouble. Uh, this city hasn't healed enough. Um, well, you just hit whoever you can. I think I have to fall back onto a road. Oh, I can, take, I can hit and then fall back, I suppose. But I do need to fall back. Uh, he'd, he'd be killed on the coast immediately. Uh yeah, let's change places with him. Uh, we'll get the splash damage done first. I, I want to concentrate on frigates. Actually, I I think I should uh, try and dent the attack of... I think we might move too much at that point. Um, I should try and dent the attack of the Danish as much as I can. Because as I said earlier, they can't be... Um, Resupply. Yeah, so there's uh, two frigates here as well. Can I get him to safety? I probably can. Let's. I think it's time to move him up the coast. 
Might as well take this last shot from there. Again, we'll concentrate on the frigates. This is looking a lot, lot scarier for me, in my opinion. Anyway, in my opinion, um, one city I can defend. Two cities against one and a half attackers. That's going to be trouble. Do we have... I'd love to be spending money on buildings and not uh, that arsenal especially, but it's just gone past the point. Um, Hermitage. Oh, we need another citizen. That shouldn't take too long. Uh, nine, nine turns. Oh, actually, that, we're starting to stagnate a little bit. Let's see if we survive this onslaught. I forgot to take into account two things. First of all, I forgot to account that the AI is really bad at coordinating. And they're getting in each other's way here. Second of all, much more importantly, we just lost the units uh, because I forgot that. Well, that's bad. Um, I forgot the Danish can just come on land. <laughs> this is uh, this is looking really bad, um, especially with that lost unit. Good thing we got that city state when we did. Does that matter? Like I need these units to come up here. Oof. You know what? Peace deal against Portugal in the next one or two turns is probably the only thing that will uh, save me here. Right, so this land unit need, needs to be killed. The Danish units seem to have pulled back. Um, I wish they'd they'd kept their unit with them. We, we might be okay if we did. Right, let's go through notifications first. And um, hit who we can. So he's still looking pretty dangerous. Uh, there's a frigate there I want to concentrate on. And um, that's a frigate, is it? Yeah, let's concentrate on that. Okay, we look the king, trade route uh, pillaged from here. So we can, we want to replace that. We got a lot of money from something though. Ah, the Mongolians, a couple of their trade routes are probably in, were probably inside our... Uh, our um, sphere of influence. Yeah, it's really annoying we lost a cannon. At least it wasn't one of the field guns though. Because it could have been anyone. Because it could have just landed there and got right in. Uh, it's taking damage from the citadel at least. Okay. Let's see. Is this. My... Here's my splash damage guy. Might get him into the city. Yeah, let's do that. You can. Attack him. Um, can I get away with killing him with that guy? I think I have to damage the cannon. Let's uh, use the splash damage guy most efficiently. Um. If he could move into that spot to kill him, then he could come down south. I might be might have done that, but screw it. Let's, let's kill him with that guy. Oh, he's dead in the citadel. That's maybe not what I wanted. Especially this Ethiopian in my way. Um, that sounded a bit rude. <laughs> I certainly didn't mean that as an any any sort of insult. Um. We have another town possible. I guess maybe this tile here looks good to me. I will concentrate on taking this um, bring it down. Okay, he's gonna have trouble getting down south. Uh, I'm not sure where it's most important to to go. I forgot to ask for peace. I, I remember it took ages last time. Uh, maybe the AI doesn't sort of recognize uh, taking that taking this unit damaging units has been that bad. I'm gonna heal this guy. Um, just because there's not that many great things to do, and if you can't go anywhere else, you might as well hit a unit there. 
Right. Tell you what, let's let's not edit this one out so you can see the damage coming in as it comes in. As it might be might be game over, depending on how much the Mongols move in. So first is Portugal. Um so I guess we're, we're keeping an eye on the health of the city for this one. Right, that's their turnover. Okay, they've just said uh, move back. They've moved back from both of them. That could be uh, an indication that they're willing to do a peace deal. Like, I can only hope, can't I? Um, now, the Danish. Let's see if they appear, because I think they're just here. They're not that far away. Well, they might be all the way over here, I suppose. Uh, but they may not be very far away. And if they have more units that can land, um, that's a lot of trouble. So that's their turn gone. Oops, I zoomed in like five seconds ago and it's, <laughs> it's still doing it. Oh, there we go. Um, right, so it's all down to the Mongols now. Real question is how many how many ranged uh, horse archers have they got? Because they can just run all the way in. And uh, hurt everyone. Oh, good. We're gonna get another, another caravan. That's a nice bit of money. Okay, not too bad yet. Uh, has all the health been taken? Yeah, that's fine. That's that's survivable. I wish my range units had more, uh, had more health though. Right, this I think this is doable. The fact that the Mongols are so weak um, is a is a great advantage to us. Let's ask the Portuguese for a peace deal. Come on, come on, Portugal. Now you left a frigate right there. I'm gonna I'm gonna take uh, gifts like that. Although the field gun has other jobs to do, so I'm afraid. You're going to have to go south. Let's make sure we're getting the range tree guys where they need to be. Yeah, back into the city just to, to boost this attack. Um, I think I'll just keep him fortified. Let's see, you can get all the way here and then do some good damage. Yeah, you still get the two attacks. Okay, you are... No, I'm not at risk from any attacks, except for maybe horse archers, which we do need to consider. Very real um, fears. Um, right, he's my biggest threat, I think, at the moment. The cannon can't really move too well. I'm going to move him here and upgrade him. You can go in there and heal and this guy's going to get as far as he possibly can. Alright, alright, that looks good. I'd like more roads down here again, but I don't think that's um, all that feasible. Maybe you can just go to sleep back at home. I'm not sure if there's that much more to do. I'll, I'll build a farm there, because why the hell not? Ooh, I can promote these guys. Yeah, I think uh, I think that's worth it. That Because I'm like i light on melee units, but having two levels above them, that could be massive. Um, what's the worker doing here, actually? <laughs> Let's get you out of there. I think we're about to build a town on that tile, so there's no need to upgrade it. Uh, I yeah I'm struggling for stuff to do with this guy and uh, you know what let's let me build an extra couple of roads up there with the intention of fighting uh, the Celts okay I like I, I'm I wouldn't be surprised oh we don't have a great general we were hitting those without great generals that was a waste Um, I wouldn't be too surprised if the Portuguese come back but I'm. They shouldn't be able to take the city too quickly. Uh, this one especially will got a bit of a reprieve. So I'll see you guys after the processing. Oh, maybe not. We'll do the town first. 
Um, how will that help our golden age? 11 down to 8. Getting there. Ah, we don't have another great person coming for a while. Uh, let me just make sure that's being used. How is your happiness? Yeah, we're, we should have been working the chancery anyway. Um, okay, so if you're unhappy anyway, let's see what tiles uh, we could probably do without. They're all pretty good, it has to be said. I'm not seeing too many bad tiles there. Two forest tiles are weak, but combined, maybe they're okay. Anything, we close on anything. We're close on riots. All right, let's get the forest out in there. And we'll get the writers in. Okay, firstly, the good news. The Mongols don't seem to be able to do much down here. Uh, bad news, Portuguese have re-attacked this city and its health is still pretty low. Much worse news, the Danish are back. They do only have caravals um, as their melee units will. These frigates look dangerous. So I think I might ignore the Mongols a little bit. Although... No, no, we're not going to be able to kill that. Ah, it's already past the point of... Um, well, let's use this guy first. Hopefully the Portuguese will surround the city and get in the, the Danish's way. They do go force the Danish. Um, so what was I looking at? I wanted to speed up this building, but it's too late for that. And the armory there should get finished at some stage soon. Okay, um, it might be worth bringing the great general down here. He doesn't quite get everyone. This guy can come up for a few moments and cover everyone. I'll, I'll think on that in a moment. Okay, he might die inside the city. And again, this is an all or nothing city. But then again, the, what I would really like to attack is here. Um... I don't see any land units, but I didn't see a land unit last time either. And he just popped right in and uh, took my units. The Citadel hopefully would help a bit. It didn't help the cannon though that was there. So what's the plan here? Um, hmm. How about this? We move everyone down a little bit. He can go into the town. He can come down here. That will let the field gun onto this hill. Hit the uh, hit the frigates. This field gun here. Hit the frigates. These two will deal with the south. Where does this guy go then? Um. Well, let's let's just see where he ends up. <laughs> yeah, that 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 works. Um. He might end up in the city as a better defender for it. Okay, so this guy's easily killed. Uh, maybe it's a little wasteful having all of these down here. Also, let me take the opportunity to heal that field gun. Oh no, he's not going to heal uh, inside this because he's already moved. So we'll take one hit. Well, might as well take two hits then. I think he's not going to heal. Um. Right, Great General can move up just to help. Is it this tile would have been missed? Every little helps. Oh, you're only range 2. But you are splash damage. Interesting. But still only 5 splash damage. It didn't get increased because uh, that's not his ability, I suppose. Damage the uh, uh, Portuguese, I think. Um, we might upgrade a cannon next. Although I could have maybe moved him onto this tile and upgraded him if I had thought about that a little more. Um, he could have then defended against the uh, melee unit attacks, but I feel these frigates would have just killed him. Let me get a road. Ah, uh, no, I don't. Well, I've started it. Might as well finish.
Right, we're still alive, <laughs> which feels, I feel like I have to remind every time. Um, although this is looking good. You know what's particularly looking bad? The fact that the, the Danish have entry into our um, um, into our city with all these frigates. He could move out of the way, hit, 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 hit. The city's in a lot of trouble. So what I'm going to concentrate on is killing this guy first. Also, this is bad, yes, but I'm feeling this, uh, this city can survive. It certainly can survive a little while. So I'm going to have to pull some of these troops back a bit to uh, back up to this attack. Um, let's get him here. Who's my splash damage? That's it, this guy here. Uh, that might be the best spot for you. Oh, you're not range three yet. Okay, well, let's move you here anyway. Now, I don't, I don't like the ch his chances of surviving in that city. I don't know about you, but it's not looking good for him. Um, here, you know what we do? We'll move him up the coast uh, to perhaps heal and just trade out with this guy. But we can't do that right now. Oh, who goes in the city then? I think he's already moved too much. I want to make sure I get my two attacks out of him. Um, yeah, I th think if I move him again, I won't get my two attacks. Okay, so you go in the city. Let's um, upgrade you. That'll help the city. It will also get him to heal. That's, that guy's not dying. Oh, he can't hit. And a field gun on this tile can hit him. Right, after he's dead, let's uh, just try and weaken the frigates. Um, and we're just hopeful, hoping that the Portuguese will move two units into these tiles. Because uh, if, he, if he doesn't, I could be in a lot of trouble. So does he move into this city? I think I, I have to. I have to um, do something about him. I can move back next, perhaps. I think this might be where it all falls apart. Yeah, I'm. I'm. I'm not going to edit this out. You can see it in live time because the Portuguese and the Danish are amongst the first three to go. I think it's on oh, Portugal first, then maybe the Sulus, and then Denmark. So what we're really hoping for here is the, the Portuguese to fill these two tiles. If he does that, we're survivable. So you can see our health went up. All right, that's bad. Um, this now leaves access to every single Danish frigate to come in and damage this city. So let's just see if he does it. He had access last time as well. Um, it, might, it was a little more congested because they were farther back. But I think they could have reached it and they chose not to. So here they're about to move, all in one spurt, I believe. Are they at war with each other? Because the Portuguese just died. Um, they're at war with Portugal. Oh my God, we might be saved. <laughs> um, unfortunately, they're at war with us as well. One of you, one of you, peace out. Like just, I don't care which. Well, I saw it would rather the Danish at this point. Um. But yeah, you're distracting each other. This is good. The Danish are on the forefront, so we need to hurt them more. Because we want to keep this war equal, so they ignore our little city. Wow. I wonder when that happens. Um, Ethiopia's uh, open borders ran out a uh, turn ago, which is good because it was getting a little bit in our way. Oh, it looks like the Mongols didn't do anything um, of import either. Wow, <laughs> um, that's good. I guess it's it's not great though. It's it's we still have to deal with the the Danish, although they do seem to be the weaker, uh, technology technologically speaking. 
Right, I think everyone has to move up the coast here. We're just going to leave this city to him to defend. Um, we can take this hill. Unit promotion. What have you got coming to you? Okay, so we've all buildings. Like, I, I just really would like to get Folly, uh, just because that's what his job is, to take cities. Again, we're, we're not doing it at the moment, though. So let's go with... In help against units. Let's take these frigates out as much as we can. They could just decimate this city so quickly. I don't see any land units either. Need to, to need to worry about that a bit. Um, I think you could survive. Sorry, who's the who's the splash damage again? I keep losing them. I thought it was him, but did we not just promote this guy? Ah, so I've just missed the... No, here he is here. Okay. Right, you go into the city just because the splash damage will be immense. I, I wish I was allowed to attack this tile. Oh no, he's only range 2 still. Um, I think we'll attack this guy. Where's the splash damage on him? Oh, there we go. A little late. And a little late. Hey! <laughs> I don't know what, what's causing that. Yeah. Seems a bit overkill to kill him with that. No, you know, I'm going to leave some of them alive. I think that might... Like, I think there might be some potential to that... Uh, oh, the arsenal. Nice. There might be some potential to leaving units weakened. Because now they're in their way. They have to heal them. They're not going to be able to do much damage. Um... Although I'm always unsure about uh, range units, can they do just as much damage or not? You know what? I can't leave him in that city because one attack would kill him. I don't see one attack coming though. So I'll tell you what, let's leave him in the city and uh, we'll get away with it. That's a hill? What? Posturous. I mispronounced that word. So I think maybe, yeah, let's get him down there. Um, okay, I'm feeling hope again. <laughs> that was such such a fun thing to see. Maybe this that's a region I shouldn't edit out the processing turns. Because uh, you guys miss out on those sort of things. Um, luckily, we left that one in. But I don't, don't foresee anything that interesting happening in this one. So we're going to edit this one out. Uh, you know what, I'm going to promote this guy just to get him to heal faster. Yeah. Oh, we might as well put you to sleep there, I think. Oh, I stopped the road then, did I? Let's, uh, let's just build a farm. Okay, I'll see you guys after the turn. Right, the Danish uh, managed a fair amount of damage against us. Um, a worrying amount, especially worried about a field gun that's inside. Also, the Mongolians have this skirmisher here. I have to deal with him because he has uh, no zone control. So I think uh, we might have to use this cannon. Yeah, I think uh, that's for the best. And we'll kill him with this guy. Right, now, we'll stick with our plan of killing frigates. Uh... Fortunately, I think the Portuguese might have been knocked um, mostly back. Let's ask for peace dudes. Uh, what am I doing I here? Did. Impossible. Impossible. Um, so maybe we get a stronger field gun inside. First of all, let's make the most of this uh, splash damage for at least a one turn. Um, I think here is the only place you can shoot someone from. Right. I'm not sure we're going to have enough to, to do enough. These, uh, these um, frigates are just too much. Again, I don't want to waste it killing that guy. But maybe I should, because he's just gonna he's still gonna be able to damage the city quite a lot. What's up here? 
Oh yeah, I keep forgetting he has such a massive amount of range. Um, so does Portugal, I think. <laughs> Otherwise, he wouldn't leave units inside. Like three turns till the constabulary is finished. That would help a lot. Um, I don't know. I guess we just sit back and hope it. Hope it's enough. Oh, here we go. Here's another guy. Yeah. There's nowhere else he can go that does anything, so let's uh, risk his life there. Corvette. Oh, we finished the brigade off. Perfect. I think that cannon should be brought down and we leave the capital empty. No, I don't know. That might be too much. Why do you keep uh, telling me waking up? I guess that would have woke him up there, the, the range unit. Right, not as much damage as I'd feared against um, the Vikings, but still, unless the Portuguese uh, have a fleet here that can take out uh, the Vikings, or can at least attack them from the back, I might be in a hell of a lot of trouble. Right, so again, we're just all out for these frigates. Uh, me two melee units, I don't think is enough. Ooh. Ah, good. He he did a great job, actually, for me. And we're going to leave him there for this reason. Um, can I actually repeat that trick by moving him here? Let's do it. Let's, uh, let's risk everything. Um, so, anyway, the trick I'm talking about is he took damage... Because these frigates must have hit him once or twice or something and ignored the city, which I think is a massive mistake. So, despite the fact that he might die, maybe we could just get it. Maybe we just hit once and we keep him alive. Oh, hello. Um, go with the range. Yeah, let's keep him alive and hopefully. He'll make the, a similar mistake and hit that guy. Okay, unfortunately, all you can reach is uh, that. Then again, if I move him out here, he'll do. He'll be able to hit a bit more valuable targets. No, he'll die in the city, though. Okay, I can't do that. Oh, that was a waste. I missed hitting that guy. My bad. Again, we'll go field. Anything that helps hitting, uh, hitting these uh, units. Okay, I don't think you can get anywhere of value. Um, anywhere to hit fr uh, frigates, I mean. Sorry, I don't know why I phrased it like that. I think it's important to start killing uh, frigates. Although, no, I don't see any of the low health guys, so they're not hanging around to attack. So, maybe they are just bugging out. Uh, caravan, I do need a new caravan, don't I? Um, I can't afford it anyway. Yeah, forget the plan of abandoning this city. <laughs> maybe I'll move him back there and we'll change up uh, plots. Uh, historical landmarks that might be good for us once we get them actually let's have a closer look what that is that does that help my that's just what archaeologists build isn't it oh great person tile improvements oh great yeah we definitely want this um yeah okay um world religion don't think it'll pass and repeal that i don't want that to happen either yeah, let's see. Well, we'll just uh, hope for the best. I'll leave you guys in on this one uh, to see if we survive, because this could be the end, my friend. Again, we're just, we'd love to see Portugal kill like a few of these units along, along the top, um, forcing Denmark to turn and attack them. That's good. Like, that's... Terry, he's surrounded. Um, that 
could influence Denmark, like especially if there's more units here that Denmark can see. Sorry, I've zoomed in. Just don't kill the city is all I'm asking. Oh, and we finished um, Constabulary, which uh, actually helped to strengthen the city as well. I don't think we just get instant health from it. <laughs> I'm, I'm nervous. That city could just... We could get a lot of noises happen here, and the city could be gone. If that's the case, game over. I don't play mostly as we're saying, look, it's already game over. Move on. But I'm not willing to accept that. I'm just not. If this city holds. That's that's looking like the Danish uh, engaged. Um, somebody that's not me, although they also spent a little bit hitting me. Have I got money for a boat? Just to clear a path, move them out there, just to soak up some damage. I, I just don't even nearly have enough for a bow, I don't think. Um, our moving of troops allowed Mongolia a little bit of purchase. The fact that the Portuguese have a field gun floating out here in the war implies to me that they have a fleet here with it. And it was just underneath the first boat. Again, I'm sort of wishful thinking here. I'm just asking for what I need to be here. I'm just gonna have to fortify the heal. You might have to. He might have to help out down here. Okay, what are we building here? We do want the printing press. <laughs> I do want windmill to help build these things, but first and foremost, I think it's the art. You know, I think the arsenal will take forever to build. Might as well build a windmill first. Um, if he's if the city's still here, then so be it. So be it, hopefully, more to the point. Oh, it looks like he did take some damage there. He may have uh, soaked up a bit of it. Can you hit him? Oh, let's hope. Oh, we finish him off with the two hits, I guess. Um, yeah, again, yeah, we're just going for frigates. Actually, we might have done a, a bit of a job here, especially if he's stupid enough to leave the caravals attacking here, um, which I'm not sure if he is, because maybe I'll turn off animations for the next uh, turn, although that would take forever. But I might watch it myself. I don't think... I think I would edit it out, though. And um, just to see what happens. I might also get away with him attacking to kill him, but I'm not sure about that either. Let me look up on that boat idea. I don't think it's even close to being feasible. Corvette, miles away. Um, I think I'll I'll play this one more turn out, and maybe we'll. And I, I think we might have time for another turn or two, um, especially because the game could end right now again. So I don't want to just to miss out on that. So, one great hope is Portuguese. I would like to see these units die and a massive Portuguese fleet is here. I don't know, like, there we go. That's like, it's a great sign that all these land units. And the other thing about these land units, hopefully that will distract the Danish. Because these are free kills, guys. Go take them. Um, and it's bad news for us in the future because these are probably coming for us, not for the Danish. It's a, it's a terrible tactic. <laughs> by the by Portugal. We might die here to the Danish, but the Danish could just take this if they want. Hopefully they're still at war. They are. Okay, here we're ready for the reshuffle. How much health's gonna be here? Good. It looks like he went after those guys. As he should, to be honest. Portugal just true. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. What the hell? Um, <laughs> okay, okay, Celts. 
uh, very well is exactly what I, I have to say to this. Uh, let's fall, get him to fall back. We need a peace deal very soon here. Um, <laughs> okay, okay. I'm willing to accept it doesn't look good. That's uh, I am willing to accept it. You know, uh, I, I'm, I, I think I'm going to fire up the same save state for the start of this game and play it again. Because this game had to have gone better if I if I didn't befriend the Sulus, I think is where it all went wrong. Um, although, the Celts are always going to go to war with me because we're neighbours. Um, but let's play one more turn. We're playing this out. We're playing this out until one of these city fall. Um, like this, that gave me such a reprieve. And... Especially, like, there's still a, a ship here alive. I still have to believe there's a fleet there. Because it just, it's what I need. Uh, peace deals. More importantly, peace deal. Impossible. Understandable. Understandably impossible. I think I'd rather heal some of these guys. Um, I think I'd rather move them to other fronts and just hope that this war doesn't come back to me. My insurance. No, no, I, that's crazy. What I need to do here is I need to. Um, I need to damage the Vikings to give the Portuguese a fighting chance against them. Or more to the point, I want them to be in stalemate. I need them to be in a stalemate. Um, and frigates are still our main priority. You know, we're. I might be able to get away with actually not using them down here. I'm worried about that guy. But I can't really reach that. Maybe I could go into the city and give him a hit. Not to over the jungle, I couldn't. Yeah, alright. Uh, kill the. Kill the boat. Splash damage. I love it. Yeah, let's go with this uh, splash damage. Uh, you're getting promoted next. You must be a pretty good tile. And I think I can maybe get away with killing. No, no, let's heal up. Let's heal him up. Oh, this city is going to be able to... It's going to help a lot with its defense. Uh, he needs to get up into the hill to be able to fight them. Wait, is this a new great general? Yeah, it is a third great general. Um, oh, I can't use it on those tiles. It'd be too big of a waste. Uh, if I had a road there, I think I'd pop it right there right now. Um, fine, this I'm I, I'm taking this guy for the future. I'm gonna take Dublin, pop it on one of these tiles. No big deal. <laughs> you can stay there now for the time being. A oh, great general being born. That's got us the golden age. Next turn is a golden age. I'm still believing. You're not gonna. You're not gonna ruin my fate. Um, all right. I will end the video there. <sighs> Understandably, next video will probably be the last one. Like, I have to accept that. What I really need is a Portuguese fleet. Like, what were they thinking, sending melee units? But I, I have to hope there's a Portuguese fleet with it. And they, they're going to fight out here, giving this city a chance to heal up. And even better, give us long enough for a peace deal to be worked out between us. At which point, I think I'll just hold the hold the Mongolians out of long hand. And move, move units up here, defend this border, get a peace deal here. At which time, all my units should have been promoted. Um, and I should be able to come down and sweep over the Mongolians. Maybe even while still defending. Because field guns are going to do a, a lot of work up here against these mountains but tune in next time see if any of that is at all possible <laughs> i have some doubts um oh yeah what else uh subscribe button right um oh those who are watch on the stem blockchain i must forgive i must uh, apologize because you guys can't see any of this pop up this is all about the uh, youtube but the subscribe button is here um the playlist is here on the bottom right and the um, previous playlist the roaming with the romans at the top right here uh, check any of that out and i'll see you guys next time have a good one